Welcome back to my channel, it's your girl a day. Yes, I'm back. It's been like a month or more. I'm sorry. Actually, I have, it's not like I just decided to take a break. Like if I could have been editing as I was going, it would have been so easy. It would have saved me a lot of stress, like stress I'm facing right now. So as you guys may or may not know, if you're my friends in person, you know that I have been in NYSC camp. Now, if you're not Nigerian and you don't know what NYSC is, NYSC stands for Nigeria, National Youth Service Corps, yeah? So basically, for a year, graduates, once you graduate and you graduate before the age of 13, you're mandated to go for NYSC. So it's like, you first go to camp for three weeks, that's an orientation program where you're like drilled, like as if you're about to become a soldier. <laughs> and you have like six hour lectures, five hour lectures, like every day, very stressful, but fun, like when you have like friends around and everything. So after the camping experience of three weeks, you then go on to the actual NYSC, which is basically, NYSC is basically for you to serve the country, like for everybody to have an experience serving the country, uh, because like, yeah, there are sectors where they need people, but people won't go there if they're not forced to go there, so basically they're forcing us to graduate. Like for example, in River State, every couple is expected to teach, because they lack teachers. So like they send all of us to like secondary schools, and like government secondary schools, yeah. So yeah, anyways. Um, the remaining 11 months are going to be used to teach or to work. Anyways, yeah, so you're going to be working and the government will be paying you a particular amount. It fluctuates, so I can't really give you guys an amount right now. So, yeah, that's what I'm currently doing. I just came out of camp on the 30th of March. Yes, yeah, 30th of March. And today is, I think, the 13th or 14th, 15th, <laughs> 15th, I guess, of april so yeah two weeks i have been trying to like get my ppa ppa stands for place of primary assignment which is where you actually do the actual nys that's where you work so i've been trying to sort out my ppa and everything i'm going to do like a terminologies video or something like this this is going to be like the start of a particular series so today's video is going to be like an introduction plus my first video so it's either i put this video out and then post the first video or i post this in addition to the first video so the first video i'm going to be doing like a series like i said if you guys want me to do like a terminologies or something i don't know if that's needed but like but if you want me to do it let me know in the comment section i will do it so for now the videos i plan to do the first video is going to be my shopping vlog which is going to kind of be like the list of things you need to carry right so i'm going to do my shopping vlog and then i'm going to, at the end of everything i'm going to like do another video where i tell you what I actually used, what I needed, I had to buy, and what I actually used in camp, okay? So, the very first video in this series is going to be my shopping vlog, like going to the markets and um, a haul. Um, it's like mainly a shopping haul, like things I got when I went to shop. So, I went to the market, so I went to my one market in Rust State, and I also went to supermarket. So, I went to Next and I went to a supermarket beside my house to get everything that I finally took to camp. Um, so yeah, that's the first video. The second video is going to probably be um, me explaining the whole registration process when you get to camp. So I'm going to tell you guys how the registration was. I took some clips, so I'm going to just put like, as I'm explaining, I'll like, put some clips on the screen. So the registration process in camp, um, then we started the actual camping experience. I'm going to give you guys the rundown of our daily activities um, up until when we go, all the social activities that we're forced to go to when you want to sleep and there is blowing big in your ear, like all those experiences, like it's a really, really fun experience when you're out. Emphasis on when you're out. When you're out, you like think back and be like, oh my God, that was so I'm like, how would be running? Or like they tell people to squat and they would blow this one and be like, okay, you should be, you are blowing for yourself. You know, it's, it's a really like an interesting, fun experience when you think about it. But like when you're there, you're just so stressed out. You just want to leave. But then you leave and then you disconnect with people that you connected with, which is another thing I'm going to talk about. It's um, connecting with people, having friends, blah, 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 doing all of that, socializing and everything. So that might not be a video of its own, it might just be part of a video that I'm going to do. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are excited to go on this journey with me. I have gone on the journey of camp already, but I'm just going to like explain everything to you guys. I hope you guys are ready to learn. If you have any questions in the course of the series, let me know down in the comment section. I will be glad to do a Q&A video at the end of everything. But like, don't be anxious. Try to have fun. Don't like have like expectations. Like, don't think that your experience will be my experience. Your experience will be better than my experience or worse. I'm not even going to play. I'm going to teach you guys how to escape 
most of these activities how to escape all these activities i'm going to tell you guys the tea everything like the societies you can join the best ones to join the worst ones to join you know the ones where you can actually chill the ones where you're not even going to be able to chill i'm going to give you guys all the dates everything so just hold on subscribe to the channel that's important so like anytime i drop a video you get an education subscribe to the channel Turn on the post notification so that you also get a reminder in case YouTube decides to send you, you know, once the post notifications are on, like you are automatically going to get notified when I drop a video. Also, follow me on my social media. I always give you guys updates on there when I'm dropping videos. So you can also know in case those two things do not work. And last but not least, share the video with your friends and family. Please, 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 please help me share my video.